What's up? How are you guys? Something a little different this week because we have a lot of new products available on Frankie's Syringe Foods as well as Frankie's Naturals. Pardon any background noise because uh, my guys are working hard at uh, putting away your egg orders. So I've been wanting to carry a lot of different like high quality organic foods products and there were also some natural hygiene and household products that you know I just can't do everything myself you know the amount of money it would cost to to develop and do all that stuff you know you'd have to buy pallets and pallets and pallets of different grains make your own bags it was just too much thankfully they do have these like natural food distributors that like Whole Foods uses and all that type of stuff so I was able to get quite a few high quality organic products that I really liked that normally you know wouldn't be able to do on my own so that kind of sped things up a lot i will say that all of the foods products you know they're kind of self-explanatory you guys have seen me eating them in my diet the naturals products i had to kind of go through all the ingredients and those are kind of what i saw as acceptable but we'll explain the natural stuff when we get to it so we have around 15 new products on the foods website ranging from grains to beans to fats nuts and seasoning uh, so we'll start at the top here with my not only favorite uh, pasta noodles but the only ones i can really eat these are the organic uh, minimally inflammatory udon noodles uh, we're selling these as mostly packs of eight and then you can also buy them individually although that is a little more expensive over here we have some white quinoa i don't have it too often but this is a very affordable organic quinoa uh, mainly a rice substitute if you do have some concerns about the arsenic white organic basmati rice i'll have this like once a week once every two weeks when i do want rice or i'm cooking something asian uh, this type of white basmati is the lowest in arsenic and if you are going to have rice uh, this is definitely the go-to we have some steel cut oats here i do these in the morning when i have time to make the overnight oats so I'll actually make it the night before and then just take it out of the pan and heat it up. It's like the most natural form of oats uh, you can have, but we also have quick oats, which we'll show you in a second, which are just a bit more convenient. All right, so next up is macadamia nuts. And if you guys don't know, these have the best fatty acid profile out of any nut because they are predominantly saturated fat. These are roasted and salted, so they are absolutely delicious. You will eat the whole bag if you guys get this. And then we have some Brazil nuts, which are more of a health food thing. You know, you have one or two of these a day for selenium and they're naturally high mineral content. Almost everything here is organic, guys. Uh, the only stuff that's not is the macadamia nuts because those don't usually come organic. And then we have some coconut water that's not organic. So here we have some organic cannellini beans in glass jar. This is nice because these are basically ready to eat if you forgot to cook beans the night before or you just want something really convenient. We do actually have bulk bags of cannellini beans available if you guys want to buy a 25 pound bag. Uh, those are under the, uh, the same beans section on the website. When you select cannellini beans, you can click the drop down arrow. If you want to make them yourself, you can get the bulk 25 pound bag, which is you know, a bit more affordable, but it's, it's a large amount and you got to make it yourself. So here we have some macadamia nut butter. I put this in my oatmeal in the morning to add fat content. Also have it with some apples if I want to add a little bit of fat to the meal. So then we have some pecan butter. And the reason I got this was that it's very difficult to find some of these nut butters on their own. Like this is literally just organic pecans and salt. So normally when you buy a pecan butter or whatever walnut butter, it has a lot of cashew or almond or like other filler nuts. Whereas this is just pure pecan, very, very high quality product. Same thing, put it in the oatmeal, have it with some fruit. You could even use it in baking recipes. This is the oil that you guys see me cook with, the liquid coconut oil, basically just plain saturated fat, MCTs. Basically use that in all my meals, whether I'm searing a steak or sauteing some onions or adding fat to a meal, this is what I use. So the coconut aminos, I haven't been using these as much lately, but they are a soy sauce substitute, sweet and salty. These are good if, you want to reduce your sodium intake because if you put just a little bit of this on the food compared to adding actual salt to it, uh, it's a lower sodium content. Organic butter beans. 
These to me have a better texture and taste a little bit better than the cannellini beans, but uh, you know, this is in the can as opposed to the jar and they're around the same price. Here are the quick oats, instant oats, organic, nothing else in them. It's just oats guys. So I add the same thing. Like if I'm doing the overnight steel cut oats, I'll add a bit of sugar and vanilla and leave it in the pot overnight. These in the morning take only a minute. So you boil the water, you add the quick oats and then the sugar and the vanilla, and then you're good to go. This is actually what I had this morning. And you know, most of the time you won't really have time to prep. So I like using the instant oats. Compared to the packet oatmeal, like apple cinnamon and the prepackaged stuff, you know, you don't have to worry about chemicals or additives or natural flavorings. Then we just have some coconut water here. I got this in because it tastes really good. You know, I, I've tried a lot of different coconut waters and this was the only one I actually wanted to drink. So the brand is Taste Nirvana. It is very expensive. These are like $10 a bottle. These are a few dollars each. It does come in glass. And it's just a good source of potassium, a little bit of sugar, great for hydrating in the morning. And because of the price point, it's not like you're going to down two or three bottles of this a day. Uh, for me, I use it as more of a treat, maybe once every two days, or if I just really need to balance my electrolytes naturally. Down here, we got some barley. Uh, definitely a little hot out to be making barley stew, but uh, that's what we eat mostly during the winter. Uh, summer, I was actually going to do like a barley and rabbit stew, but haven't gotten around to sourcing some rabbit. This is just all purpose flour. This is what I'm currently using for my bread. And then we have some whole wheat pastry flour. So normally whole wheat flour is kind of coarse. This is ground very fine. And the reason you want to use whole wheat flour is just to add a fiber content to something. So if you're going to make like muffins or cookies or whatever, it's very, very dense. So you're better off using a whole wheat pastry flour. And then when I make my bread, I actually like using like 25 to 30% whole wheat flour just to add a little bit of fiber to it, uh, the white bread. So it's not just pure dense starch. Add some gut motility, soluble fiber, good for detoxing the liver. So it's not like a crazy, crazy amount of products, but compared to what we were offering on the, the foods website, it's, um, it's like double what we have. Bro, this, this tape gun is driving me crazy. So we got quite a few new products on the naturals. You guys know we had a fairly limited selection, uh, just like six or seven homemade things, you know, deodorant, tooth powder, moisturizer, uh, hair pomade, clay shampoo. We've got the bug spray and the black soap. Now the two things that I couldn't source, the bug spray and the hair pomade, are still like the only thing we have in that regards. But everything else, we have substitutes for the most part. On the left side here, I have a lot of household stuff. Like if you want hand soap, we got dishwasher gel, we got the dish soap for washing in the, in the sink. We got multi-purpose spray cleaner, even have like dryer sheets here for your dryer. This is non-chlorine bleach for your whites, and then we just have the regular laundry detergent. A lot of you guys were asking me, you know, what do I use in my household for stuff? These were the products I was getting in the store, and I'm happy to offer them to you guys. Honestly, like, one of these laundry detergents lasts me over a month. This lasts forever. This stuff, months, months, and months, you know? I'm one guy, so, you know, each of these things will last me for a few months. But, you know, if you have a family, Maybe you'll go through it. It's still still very, very affordable, comparable to prices that you're paying for the regular product in the store. I'm not going to go too much into these. You guys can look at the ingredient list. We have them on the website, frankiesnaturals.com, and everything is broken down into sections. Uh, what I will spend a little more time talking about is the new natural products that are kind of somewhat intended to replace these as, you know, I'm focusing more on the meat business, and I just don't have the time or the setup to be making certain cosmetic products right now. So these are the ones that, like I looked at the ingredients, all of them were acceptable, which is why there are so many different brands here. Because I looked at you know every company that produced toothpaste or whatever, and I, I chose the best one. Deodorant, I chose the most acceptable one. And, and for the most part, all of them have excellent ingredient lists and their stuff I'm using now myself. So we'll start over here. This is just a bar soap and 
like the affordable option because we do have a lot of different shampoos and body washes and all that type of stuff. But if you just want like a minimally inflammatory soap with just a few ingredients, I like this a lot because it only has like a form of coconut, some water, and then just a little bit of fragrance. Um, even less inflammatory than the black soap actually. So I like those a lot. I think they're like two or three dollars each. Then we'll move over here. So we have some lip balm, lemon lip balm I tried. It's pretty good, I like it. Uh, container is pretty convenient. Kind of the same as, as the one we have now. This is actually a face moisturizing cream. You know, again, I looked through all the ingredients on all the products and this was the only like actual moisturizing cream with that specific moisturizing texture that I liked. I've used this, the ingredient list is excellent even though it has a lot of stuff in it. It's all minimally inflammatory stuff. So I kind of like that as a face moisturizer. Here we have some mouthwash, which I never thought I'd be carrying, but I looked at the ingredients. I was like, well, someone has half of an idea of what they're doing. So it's nice to have. Not everyone wants to have stinky caveman natural breath. This is just a plain mint toothpaste, a lot more convenient than the tooth powder. You know, just put it on the toothbrush instead of dipping it in and making a bit of a mess. Here we have a cinnamon natural floss. I was gonna get mint, but they ran out of mint, so uh, maybe next time we'll have the, the mint floss, but for now we just have a bunch of cinnamon floss. Main thing is, guys, I tested this floss out. You know, it's not like some weird paper-based floss that's kind of hard to go between your teeth. It, it's very thin and it's very easy to use. This is the new deodorant we're carrying, the Toms of Maine unscented and lemongrass deodorants. You know, instead of having the deodorant in the tub that we have, you know, this is a bit easier to put on out of the stick. We have some natural shaving cream. I don't really shave that much myself, maybe once a week, once every two weeks, but if you're gonna shave a lot or you want a natural shaving cream, that's pretty good. With my tattoo now, I started putting some sunscreen on it. So, yeah, I mean, most of the time, like, a lot of people won't ever have to wear sunscreen, but under certain exceptions, like you have a tattoo or you're really, really, really pale or you're out in the sun for excessive amounts, we do have a natural sunscreen zinc base that you guys can use. Then we have two body butters, moisturizing creams. So this is just like pure unrefined white shea butter. Nothing else in it. This is as basic as you can get. If you have a problem with any type of moisturizing cream and you still have a problem with this one, then you're out of luck because this is as minimally inflammatory as it gets. This is the same thing, but it's whipped up with a little bit of coconut oil. So it has a better texture, but uh, you're combining two different things. It's, it's a little more heated compared to, to this, which is just a, a pure unrefined shea butter. But I like both of them. Very, very similar products. It just depends on you know, whether you want something that's a little more expensive and easier to apply or something a little more natural. Uh, here we have some body wash. So I like this better than soap. This is just unscented body wash. You just, you know, squeeze it onto your rag or, or washcloth or whatever. Whereas, you know, with the soap, you kind of have to lather it and it takes a lot more time. And then we have a conditioner and a shampoo. This says it's for curls, but it's really just like a general conditioner and a general shampoo. Uh, you know, most people, you don't really need to use a conditioner unless you have like curly hair and you want to keep the curls. So for me, I usually just use the body wash every day if I was working a lot or like I did something dirty and my hair kind of smells, I will use the shampoo. And then um, since I do have curls, I, I do like using the conditioner after I use the shampoo. So, uh, you know, these are, these are some products that like for me to make myself <laughs> probably wasn't going to happen anytime soon because you need special equipment, but I'm happy to carry this brand. Granted, they don't run out of it because guys, it really is a mishmash of, of different stuff and what I kind of chose as uh, what I thought was... Uh, the best ingredients and the least inflammatory. Yeah guys, so it's nothing too crazy. I'm happy I was able to find and source these products so that I could focus more on the meat business and some other stuff instead of <laughs> trying to figure out how to make a body wash. So uh, something to be said about that, but you guys can go to Frankie's Free Range Foods where we have all of those new products and things I'm eating in my diet every single day. And then you can go to frankiesnaturals.com if you like to you know, buy some household stuff that we've never had before or if you just want to try some more convenient versions of some products we've been offering. FrankieStrangeFoods.com, 
frankiesnaturals.com. Uh, what we'll probably do is uh, just show you guys a brief overview of, of these every time we do a vlog for the next few weeks. Uh, nothing too crazy going on with the meat business, so maybe we'll just do uh, another regular vlog next week to update you guys. And uh, you know, if there's any products you guys like that you'd like me to carry for the most part, uh, this is kind of everything that I really wanted because you know, I'm currently having a lot of this stuff in my diet. I'm using it in my lifestyle, in my household, cosmetic stuff, hygiene stuff. Uh, so for me, this was kind of the bare minimum, and then maybe we'll add some stuff here and there. But as always, thank you guys for joining me. Make sure to drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below, subscribe and check that notification bell, and maybe you guys can uh, you know, keep supporting me so I can purchase some type of tape machine so you guys don't have to hear the tape gun in the background all the time. <laughs> Frankie's Strange Foods, Frankie's Naturals. I'll see you guys soon.